Welcome to a special edition of the Great Island Show. I'm your host, Abron Trebu. I have some special guests with us today. I just want to let you guys know that you can reach out to us at, at @gridcommish on Twitter, lbgridiron.com. You can also find us on Facebook at lbgridiron. But nonetheless, I'd like to do. I'd like to introduce our special guest today, Mr. Michael Sachs. He's back with us for another edition of the Gridiron Show. Thank you very much for doing this. I'm, I'm doing great. Thanks. Thanks for having. Uh, thanks for joining us today. Yeah. Pleasure to have you. Mike, uh, we, we got spe some special things going on this week. What are we doing? Some special segments, and, and we're going to test your knowledge a little bit about some sports picks, but we're also going to see how you feel about what's going on in our league. All right. I'm picking games for week 10, aren't I? Yes, sir. You All know. right. So hold on just one moment, people. we got a special, special edition set up for you today. We're going to see what Mike does against my daughter, Anissa, a fourth grader, see if he can pick better than a fourth grader this week. You up for the challenge? I think so. All right, let's try it. All right, so week 10. We're going to put our season finale to test and see what Mike and Anissa do uh, against our picks. So Anissa's out there every single week. She's part of our staff. Um, we're going to see how we're going to see how they match up this week. So we'll keep track and we'll let you guys know how they did. So very first week, Mike, I'm going to challenge you a little bit and ask you to give us a score as well. Is that okay? Absolutely. All right, so 9 o'clock game. Fubar in second to none. Who's going to win, Anissa? Fubar. Wow, she's wow. picking upset. Wow, second to none, 28-12. All right. Sub so Zero versus Transformers. Who you got, Mike? Oh, Transformers, thirty to zero. Who do you think? Uh, Transformers. Transformers. All right. She's gonna she's gonna go with you on that one. Ten o'clock game. We got on field one. Mad Dogs versus Monsters. Who do you got? Monsters. One. Mad Dogs, thirty to twenty-eight. Wow. Game of the week. Nice. Uh, at ten o'clock on field two, All My Mama Cub versus Wise Guys. Who you got, Mike? Thirty-five-seven. All My Mama Cubs. Right. Who do you got? Mama Cubs. Okay. You guys, daddy, bro. you guys agree with that? 11 o'clock, Body Shop versus Monstars. Who do you got, Anissa? Body Shop. Ooh, I'm going to have to go Body Shop also. Monstars coming in, playing their doubleheader. Body right. Shop, 14. Monstars, 12. All right, Mike, you got Sin City Kings versus the Savages. Ooh. Sin City Kings, 21. Savages, 12. Who do you got? Sin City Kings. Sin City Kings. All right, at 12 o'clock, All In versus Nellis. All in 20, now it's 19, overtime. Ooh, who do you got? All in. Good pick. Nice. A one o'clock game, beer leaguers versus Wolfpack. Who do you got, Anissa? Wolfpack. Ooh. Well, I'm going beer leaguers. 14-13, uh, real nice. close game. Uh, two o'clock game, Hot Boys versus Air Raid. Who do you got? Air Raid. What's Hot Boys record? Oh, it's not good. Yeah, Air Raid, 40 to 14. Ooh, wow, blowout. Blowout. It's their defense. Hot Boys defense is not good. Three o'clock game. Bad Boys versus Airy. Who do you got, Anissa? Bad Boys. 27 20 Airy. Wow. Okay. You're picking an upset there. Um, all in versus Rampage at four. And, and, and think Jimmy's probably going to quarterback that game. Jimmy's going to quarterback that game? Yeah. Then that would be Rampage. Do you think Rampage's going to be his? I still think they'll beat you. 20 to 12, all in. All in. All right. And, and then last but not least, uh, our Empire versus Las Vegas Saints. Who do you got in that game? Empire. Empire. Um, Empire. I'm going to go with the Saints. Uh, I know they're not even in the league they're, anymore. You know they're not playing? Yeah, I do know that they're not playing. I feel like Empire will lose to themselves, and the Saints come out with this victory 6-0. Well, there you have it. <laughs> there you have it, folks. Oh, Wes, that was Sachs. That wasn't me. There you have our pitch for this week. I want to thank our special guests, Anissa Travey, my youngest daughter, and Mike. Um, we'll see how these picks stack up, and we'll see who wins this football here. All right, thank you very much, Francis. Where's my kiss? <laughs> Good night. You know, we're giving thanks this week, you know, Thanksgiving and all. So we had to come up with some special editions, and we want to take advantage of your time with this. So are you ready for this? Absolutely. I can't wait for this. We want to introduce our very first segment, right? Something similar to Come On Man that we see on ESPN. Come on, man. So what we're going to do is we're going to, we have a new segment called What The Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> so this new segment will just highlight some of the things that we've seen in our weekly video. So we've had some really, really nice plays, and What Does, you know, everyone enjoys those every now and then. So we're going to take a look at our very first one. Um, this one features a man Cole, you know, very 
very good opportunity for us here just to review some of the games and see what's happening. You ready for this? Yeah. yeah. So many of you have probably seen several of these plays already if you watch our, our weekly videos that Joey's been so nice to put up. But let's check out this play here. Corey does a nice job avoiding the rush. Cole gets the ball up the field. I thought Just he was three, four players. I thought he was going to score on this. And Cole. pitches it to Nellis. Cole, what the? What the? <laughs> that was crazy. That was six. Oh, he sixed that, they too. Six, all the way to the house, man. I'm going to blame this loss on Cole. This whole loss. Yeah. This whole loss on Cole. 35-14. Blame it on you, Cole. That was that was tough. But I mean, in that situation, I'm I'm a firm believer of the pitch, so I I, I enjoy pitching. You have to pitch, good. but what's with the no look pitch? Yeah, that's true. I mean, you, you, it's a seven point game. You're driving. You're on the 15 yard line, about to get a first and goal from the 15, and you pitch a house call. He, he was expecting pitches. one of his teammates to be there. It's, it's not DX, man. <laughs> it's not, that this is true. It's, it's, not de DX. it's definitely not DX. Definitely not DX, but I felt bad for Cole. He felt really bad thinking that he had somebody, you know, there for him. But we want to check out another one since this being the game of the week here. Look at Donnie there getting uh, going up against the big dude. And Donnie holds he holds his own every now and then. Donnie is one of the best rushers in the league, in my opinion. Hands down. Here's another play. I believe. Oh, that was crazy. That was crazy. I, I, can, is there is there a way? That we could just see that again. Is there a way we could see that again? Did you see that? I think that's Kirk Schnakenberg. It has to be a. That's the whitest name I've ever heard, and that's the whitest play I've ever seen. Let's let's so. Look at this. Oh man! Right here, people. This guy right here. What the fuck were you thinking? <laughs> he he was trying right to make here. a play. He was trying to make a play. He was half making a play. Look. Oh. The rolled over feet over the top. He, he feet came man, over the top. Big man's looking at him talking trash. By that time, the game was probably over, huh? 27-14. The game was pretty much out of reach at that point in time. This is just for good measure. Yeah, that was that was tough. So, what the? What the? What was he thinking of now? I, I'm not going after that big guy. I'm a, I'm a big dude. I'm not going after that big guy. Jesus. So, with, uh, with, with our first edition of what the? Uh, pretty, two pretty good, pretty good scenes there. It, think of anything else you you've seen that deserves a what the? Um, yeah, I, I can always have a couple what does for Yoder. Yoder. Yeah. <laughs> Yoder. Yoder had a couple what the fuck are you thinking plays on this in this game? Yeah. Go to the first one. Did you get a chance to watch the game? I, I I didn't watch the I didn't watch it live, but I did watch the video of the game, and there's a few things that I've come across that is really funny to me in this. Yeah, Yoder. Yoder. You and Yoder are way back, huh? Watch this. Look at, oh, it's like he's playing on the ice skating rink. <laughs> ice skating rink. <laughs> what the fuck happened to your feet? <laughs> That's what I want to know. That was that was crazy. I don't know what happened. I mean, he was trying to spin move. He thought this was going to be something that, that... Well, watch Yoder, people. Oh, Yoder. Yoder's like a statue that can't move. Wow, what the... Good game though. Good game of the weekend. Gave us some good some good entertainment during that. It was a great game. Yeah. The score was a lot closer, I felt. The game was a lot closer than the score uh, really said too. Yeah. So what the? There you have it, people. Our very first edition of What the with Mr. Mike Sachs himself. So we got a we got a couple of other segments we'd like to introduce to you guys this week. Um, one of them actually being, you know, something I'm a huge Lakers fan, you know. And, and I know, guy. I know. I, I still admit it. Huge fan of Shaquille O'Neal, so you know you've heard of his Shaq and the Fool. Yeah, yeah. So I, I thought we'd come up with something called Sack and the Fool. Okay. Or Sacks and a Fool. No. Sacks and a Fool. Sack and the Fool. Sack and the Fool. Sack and a Fool. Sack and a Fool. Sack and a fool. Okay. All right, so Sack and a Fool. So what do you what do you have for us for Sack and a Fool this week? Um, I, I know the very, one of the first ones you wanted to see. It came in. The, it came in this game as well, right? Which one? So, so it was right around six thirty-two mark as well. Let's 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 take a look at this. Re refresh my memory. So dropping interceptions. Just some things we we enjoy. Oh, right here. Action. Oh, oh, the hands like feet. Hello, feet hands. <laughs> there they are. And the sun was in his the, eyes. All the, the sun, sun was in his eyes. Even though the eyes. sun's coming from the north and you're going south. Yeah, the sun so was the in sun his eyes. Eye. I, okay, cool. I must say he did he did make up for it. And, yeah. Nice hands, you feet. Gotta, you pick, nice you hands, pick, say. feet. That was bad. He was sat in full on that one. Uh, there was another. There was another play earlier uh, that we got a chance to see. Look at this. I mean, God, you could have that. That was a house call. Yeah, that's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. 
But, you know, there was another play right after that, actually. Uh, that was actually a fourth down play, right? They turned the ball over. They did turn the ball over, and then I believe Roundtree abuses the body shot. Talk us through this. Tell us, tell us what happens right here. So they play action down, play action down, hit Roundtree on the screen. He makes this first dude Whoop. miss. Donnie looked like Whoop. a fool, oh. and then beasts out. Uh oh, Slim's gonna catch him. Slim's gonna catch him. Slim's, no. Slim, Slim's walking to get water right now. That's where Slim's going. Slim's not catching him. That was, uh, he was sacked and full now. That, he was definitely sacked and full. That's now. crazy. That, that, that guy's got speed, man. You probably had a few of those in your day, huh? I've never ran that far <laughs> in my life. Let's watch that again. This was, this was, this was really nice. I see Donnie uh, going. Donnie came after this fight. Nice effort, Donnie. Bro. Great effort by Donnie. One of my favorite Donnie. players in the league right here with but the white not, hat. He's not getting there. Well, he was just so far out of position from right here. But look at the rest of the players on his team standing still and Whoop. him, like, going 100 miles an hour. Like, oh, Donnie was going to be. Oh, Donnie, <laughs> almost. And slam. Is that Weasel? That's Weasel. Oh, that's Weasel. Been, his knee was all right after that shit he took. His knee seemed <laughs> fine in that picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Weasel. He could have been all sack in the pool if he had oh, that video. Man. That was a teammate of yours. To see him get, I thought he was done. I thought his knee was I, missing. I, I thought it buckled, and then Weasel came off the field, and he was like, well, you guys should know that, like, in the 50s, my <laughs> knee, it pops in and out of place every now and then. So, it's like Mel Gibson's shoulder, lethal weapon. That's, you know, that's what Weasel's like. That's hilarious. Well, you know, that's another good episode of, of Sack and a Fool, the very first one. You, anybody else you think you would like to add to Sack and a Fool? Yoder. You <laughs> gotta go on Sack and the Fool now, Yoder. Let's see it. Roll talk. Roll tape. Wow. Poor Yoder. Let's see. Let's see what Yoder did. Oh, oh! It's tantrum time. <laughs> what the fuck? Stop blocking! What are you doing? Block, Bill. Block. Bruh! Block. What was that? What was That's that? what he does. He does that once a game. He likes to let his offensive line know I'm there and you're bothering me. I'm upset <laughs> by what you're doing. I need a little ush. Because if he doesn't get this ush. He's not, he's not a very happy man. Let's roll it again. That was pretty, that's pretty bad. Let's roll it one more time so we can see it. You know, some people might think you're picking on Yoder right now. Nah, man, I love Yoder. Yoder's my dude. Yeah. I, I, Yoder's I think, a good player. I think he's a really good quarterback. He's, a, he's way better than I am. <laughs> so... <laughs> No, no problem with picking on him. I'm sure he's, he's a big Well, he was in the game player. of the week this week, and he had quarterback position. You're always under the spotlight, Absolutely. and he's in it. And I just had to give a little shout-out to you. So when you have game of the week, you know we're going to have you up here. And we're going to be There's a, already a game of the week that's up there. We can go through it. We need to. We may need some good stuff that. in there. We may need to look at that. You know, well, well thank you very much. Hope you guys enjoyed our, our new segments. What the <laughs> fuck? And sack and a fool. Till next time. As we bring a special addition to a close, I'd like to give our special guests any opportunities they can. You know, I can uh, ask any questions. You got any questions for me as the commissioner of the league? Or? Um, well, just uh, what are some of the new additions you have for the league to, uh, you know, implement some good stuff for the players? Like, what do you have in store for us? You know, that, you know that's a good question. I'm excited to actually introduce that. I was hoping to get something out this week. And one of the things we're doing is we're offering four and four uh, over the the winter season, and hopefully going forward, um, like so you sign up for an eight on eight, and then you eight play on four on four. Absolutely. So if you're in an eight on eight league, the eight on eight registration is two hundred and fifty dollars. On top of that, be fifty dollars if you want to get your team into four on four plus the ref fees. Um, if you're not playing in an eight on eight, then the entry fee for the four on four league will be a uh, hundred dollars. That's a you know we're playing by letter five rules. It's gonna be an exciting thing for us. Something I don't think Vegas has seen for great action four on four. The other thing we're imp implementing are some some weekend uh, an overnight trips for the MVPs of the league. Overnight um, trips. Overnight trips. So uh, each MVP in the in their division and one random player will have the opportunity to, to join the commission on an overnight trip to either a baseball game, an NFL game, or an NBA game. Oh uh, wow! Flight, hotel, everything included. So uh, that's good. that's going to be awesome. Um, so Josh, he gets to go to an NFL game, a, a basketball game, and a baseball game. There you go. <laughs> Complimentary. <laughs> just to join the league, and, we'll, and we'll just pick one random player to join us. So it'll be awesome. You don't have to be an MVP. Oh, like everyone puts like a raffle. Absolutely. You can just pull. Absolutely. So that's going to be exciting. A bunch of things coming up. Feel free to follow us on Twitter at, at @gridcommish. We're also on Facebook, as I mentioned earlier. Um, you'll also find us at lvgridiron.com through our forums and things like that. 
I, I just want to let you guys know I appreciate everything you guys do. Thanks for showing up every Sunday, making our league you know get better and better every single week. A big shout out to our um, to, I'm sorry to our commissioner myself, um, as well as our, our referees and Robbie and everyone else. I want to tell you guys have a happy Thanksgiving. Stay safe out there. God bless. I'll let you in the show. I think you pretty much nailed it right there. Only thing I want to say is Yoder, don't hit me when you see me at the fields, okay? I love you, my dude, all right? I love you. And uh, I do want to say one thing. I think that your refs are fantastic. I think Unico is the, probably the best ref in all of Vegas. And if you had just a few more of him, oh, man, it, w it would be really incredible. I appreciate that. That guy's phenomenal. I he love really he needs a He needs a legit shot out from the league because he is a really great ref. That's so why we made our head ref. Just a move. Yeah. Get a raise and a bonus? I, I can neither Company confirm car? nor deny that. Company car? <laughs> awesome. Thank you very much for watch watching. We really appreciate it. See you guys soon with our playoff edition. Thank you.